building a Chinese empire. Good day, everybody, and here we are again, lapping up some live Command & Conquer Zero Hour action. This is Alfie Ace on the ball. <laughs> yeah, serving up, guys. We love it, don't we? The greatest RTS game ever, and uh, no doubt about that. Command & Conquer Zero Hour. Um, what have we got for you today, then, guys? Something a little bit different. I don't often do 2v2 games. But there was a call put out for a streamer, if there was any streamers available to do this game. And it's Ammo and Moon Knight versus Hummo... H Hummo. Hummy. <laughs> Hummy and Hesso in a best of 11 challenge sponsored by the one and only Pepsi. $100. So nice. $50 for an afternoon's work for the victors of this challenge. Um... Let's head over to the lobby because I think the players are going to be um, ready to rumble. Sort a few little screens out and do my jiggery pokery. Excellent. Yeah, got a poll up at the moment. Let's uh, quick look at that. 89% of you going for ammo and moon night. Nine votes. Thank you, guys. And only 11% going for hummy and hesso. Yeah, I don't know about that. Um, I think it might be closer than that. I mean, Hummy is a really good 2v2 player and a good team player. Good 1v1 player when he spams as well. So um, let's get into the Radmin room and see. Yep, guys are here, so that's good. Moon Knight's here. Otherwise, uh, also known as 
Wraith as well. Yeah, to get Wiggle on, guys, to get this stream up and running and do me thumbnail and all the jiggery pokery needed as a streamer. <laughs> Getting the late call. I was having a bit of lunch at the time. Belly comes first, isn't it, guys? And we got Ammo in the room. Ammo's joined us. So two of the players with us. Um, that's the first team, Ammo and Moon Knight. So we were now waiting for Ami and Esso, Team H. First match is um, Tank Stealth and then Reversed. Not sure what map it's on. Um, I'm not the host, so I'm not picking the maps and all the rest of it, so that's good. Easier day for me, which I like. <laughs> Who doesn't like an easy life, eh, guys? That's for sure. There is a three-minute delay on the stream, folks. Um, I normally... Um, there were two minute delays, but there's a hundred dollars on the line with this one. So when, um, when money's involved, I, I put, um, yeah, I put a little bit extra on the, uh, on the stream to the delay, put a little bit of music on as well. Things rocking in a rolling. Oh, I'm looking forward to this one. It's a bit more work on a 2v2, more action, obviously. Four players instead of my beloved 1v1 matchups. So, oh, I see, yeah, stealth tank. Yeah, I understand. We're on FE no bug. Reminds me a bit of Twilight Flame looking at this. This map. Six viewers, welcome everybody. Don't be shy. Say hello in chat. Good to hear from you. See who we've got watching. 91% <laughs> now. Um, going for ammo and moon night in this best of 11 challenge. $100 on the line. Wow. Yeah. That's a big swing. Clear favourites there. Ammo and moon night. I don't think it's going to be that big a gap between these two teams though, I have to say. Could be proven wrong won't be the first time guys <laughs> and homer simpson welcome to chat good to see you again yeah and 2v2 is normally my li limit now on um game size um I'm, I'm not a fan at all of 3v3s and twilight flame and all that it's great we've got all the sponsorship don't get me wrong guys i'm not knocking it it's just not my cup of tea 1v1s is my favorite i have done a few free-for-alls as well but that's hard work as well and with my um disability and and the fatigue i often have to work through it's uh all a little bit too much if you know what i mean yeah, 2v2 stream, Homer. Um, yeah, relatively new. Some I have done them before. I, I have done a few before. But um, there was nothing else around today. My tournament's a bit hit and miss, sad to say, with games getting played. Um, tried to G the players up. Um, get a bit of a wiggle on deadline for my tournament in the $150 smash and grab round robin with the top players in is 10th of June. And that will be the deadline. If games aren't played, games won't be played and we'll be off with their heads. <laughs> no, but that will be the end of the, the tournament, 10th of June. I'm not one to pussyfoot around with waiting after deadlines. I had five weeks to play five games, so more than enough time. But this challenge is a hundred dollar challenge sponsored by Pepsi. Also known as File for 24, 74, I'm not sure, 64, I'm not sure exactly what the numbers are. Um, he's from the United States, put $100 into this challenge, so that's really kind of him. Not sure if he'll be with us today. And Big Facey in chat, welcome. 
to see you. Yeah, I'm doing okay, Homer. We got beautiful sunshine here in the United Kingdom again, and the Hummeister joins us, Mr. Hummy, going for US, uh, going for Super Weapon General, Naughty Billy. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm doing okay. We got great weather here again. We've had a a run of beautiful weather. Um, so that's good. Love a bit of summer weather coming in now in the United Kingdom. We've got a forecast that says we've got quite a bit more. I'm looking forward to me fishing chips tonight, Saturday night, takeaway night. That's a, a UK tradition. Fish and chips. Ooh. You don't know what you're missing, guys, if you have mad fish and chips. I'll tell you that. So I expect all these guys will be in voice chat. Well they should be if if um they're not, then uh, it'll make it that much harder for them, that's for sure. And people joining chat, Last Drop and Madara, welcome. We got the good, the bad and the ugly here in chat now. <laughs> <laughs> You'll all be leaving if I'm rude, won't you guys? I'm not standing for that, I'm off. 77% <laughs> of you now voting for... I'm Owen Moon Knight, 23% going for Hummy and Hesso. I shall end the poll there because we're just about to get into the first game, dudes. And rock and roll we shall be. Bear with me, guys, if I miss things. Every streamer, it's impossible, I think, with 2v2s to um, get everything right. Um, that's for sure. So... Um, Team Ammo, Team Moon Knight are in the bottom, and China Tank in red for Moon Knight, bottom right, and his teammate to the left. GLA Stealth for Ammo, top left. We have in blue, Ammo's playing in purple. In blue, we have Hummy, China Tank, and to the right, playing in gold. GLA Stealth and Hesso. Yeah, I'm not that familiar with this map. I think I have seen it. I think I've played it. In a four player free for all in the past. So you got safe dock in base there, dock in the middle, which Hummy's going for. He's going obviously for his supply in his dock. Um, dock here in the center, and obviously the opposite. No oils on this map, I do believe. Ooh, interesting. Ammo sending. Workers forward, of course, to build tunnels, and there's a terrorist waddling forward, getting two tunnels up there. Forward wall factory for Moon Knight. Hmm. And two wall factories then. Looks like one supply at the moment. Or no, he's going for that forward supply as well. Terrorist did get in here, and looks like denied that tunnel. Oh, look at this. There's a hijacker. Sneaky hijacker. I'm not sure who's who he belongs to. Probably, um, probably Hesso. Dragon in the middle from Moon Knight. Setting about this tunnel, burning up workers. And um, we've got a tech as well, trying to get in. He does get in. Starts to kill Hesso's workers here. Uh, ammo being a nuisance there. Oh, look at this hijacker. He's after the dozer. But, oh, sorry, the dragon. He gets it. That's um, Hesso, I do believe. Got that dragon now. There's an outpost here from Moon Knight and a gap setting about this supply collection for Hesso. Oh, look at this captured dragon. Wrecked that war factory. Took that down. Moon Knight lost that one. And his base is wide open to this dragon. Grief man. Oh dear, it's bad. Losing the dozer there is Moon Knight. Now I don't know what the rules are for putting out in this. Power's gonna go down. That dragon will go down. Yeah. He took out the power and the war factory, remember, so he can tunnel here by Moon Knight. Hmm. A bit of red here. 
That's a, a power. Oh yeah, power trying to get up here from Moon Knight. Oops. Let's click from the streamer. <laughs> okay. Battle Masters for Hummy there. Hmm. All players still level one. A load of RPGs coming. Oh no, sorry, tank hunters from uh, Moon Knight. That was uh, a good pop from his teammate there. Ammo as well. Tr he's trying to press forward with these quads. So he's got his own quads to try and scare him off with a couple of BM battle masters from the Hummeister there as well. Okay. Mind his supplies. So he's only collecting from one area is Moon Knight. Grief. Yeah. That's a, that's a struggle, isn't it? Only collecting off of one eco. And the team in the north, Hummy and Hesso, are pressing now. The gold and blue army pressing in. Big pop from Ammo. With quads. And he gets back into that magical teleporting device. Known as the GLA tunnel. That's going to get cleared up. And the GG from Ammo and Moon Knight. There we have it. You have been defeated. So Ammo and Moon Knight lose the first game. Let's get the score up, guys. Ami and Hesso take game one. Well played. Both are pretty quick, wasn't it? Welcome, B Legacy. I mean, he needs to follow every word of the Syrian conqueror, aka Hesso. <laughs> Very good. Um, last drop. We are on Tournament A for the next map. In and out, says so. so. Shake it all about. Hmm. Well, that first game goes against the pole, doesn't it? Damo and Moon Knight, 77... Uh, 77... 76% voted to win. Hummy and Hesso. Took that first game. I will work. Thirteen viewers at the moment. Welcome everybody. Hit the likes if you haven't already, and love to have your subscriptions if you um, haven't already subscribed to my channel, guys. Great to have you on board. All right, so we've got Tox and USA versus Air Force and China. Interesting. Wow. Hmm. I'd say Tox and USA got the, the more favorable armies what do you reckon guys I don't know though I mean Air Force we know how powerful that is um, especially when the generals powers start swinging into into motion pretty devastating isn't it hmm Dara asking me to lower the music. Okay, dude, I shall do that. Hope that's better for you. So asking for a second. It's <laughs> the last drop that sneaky tunnel oh my goodness me well into game two we go folks map this for 2v2 bottom right in purple we have ammo gla tox and top right his teammate moon knight in red usa vanilla Visit him in gold 
we have USA Air Force for Hesso and in green, the green machine, we have China Vanilla for Hummy. Hmm. He places that scaffold for his supply center. So you got a lot of crates here. RT platform, two oils here, very important. Replacement pads. Big dock there and a refinery on the top and a lot of crates left and right left and right here in the middle worker coming immediately forward then for ammo has to be expected drone taken out by moon knight here he's going for a drop as well expect that will be on hesso picking up missile defenders i think he got a dozer in there as well oh perhaps not perhaps he's coming in on hummy with this yeah Coming for the oils. He wants that black gold, boys. Yep, drops his dozer. Oh man, that's not good. Oh, Hummy could have crushed the whole lot there if I had been a better truck driver. Moon Knight got away with that. God, did he ever, guys? That could have been a disaster. Ammo coming north here to these two oil derricks. Well, Ammo and Moon Knight have made the better start, I think, as into the oils, although Hummy is across to try and counteract that. There's a barracks up here for Moon Knight, as we can see, and that dozer's there. He proceeded to drop these missile defenders in Hummy's base. He's setting about the power now. I reckon they could latch onto that dozer there. That's a good laser lock from Moon Knight. Nice. Supply center mined. All going for the crush, but he's not going to get it. There's still two missile defenders surviving here. Hummy's brought forward a GAT here. Ammo getting a tunnel up in his teammate's base. These two missile defenders still surviving. Hummy's in trouble. Hummy is in trouble. What's Oh man, what's he doing with his dozer? Has he got another dozer up here? Yeah, he has. I see. Trying to repair that um, power, isn't he? That's another good laser lock. But down to one missile defender. Mm. No help from his teammate yet. His first wrap is up. That's why three airfields going up for Hesso. Needs to deal with this missile defender. He will now. He laser locks on the truck. He wants to get a last bit of payback. And the missile defender goes down. Meanwhile, forward tunnel going up here for ammo. And the wrap coming in now from Hesso denies that tunnel going up. Uh, Moon Knight's got both oils though here. That's good. Really good. So ammo collecting there. Collecting off two supplies. His teammates on two oils. It's Comanche's coming over from uh, Hesso as well. With a gat from Hummy. Yeah, it's good play from uh, Hesso and Hummy. There's good combination. Killing the Rangers and the Gats camped on the barracks. Hmm. Three airfields. Wow. Well, if he gets that amount of wraps up, it's going to be uh, quite something, isn't it? A lot of purple in the middle here, though. Once, and he's already collecting from this supply center his ammo. Dealing with this dragon and takes it out. St Stealth Comanche's in from Hesso. Hmm, going commies. Three airfields and commies. Interesting. And Hummy's pressing with a dragon here as well. Neither of these oils have been taken yet. Looks like Moon Knight's trying to get them, but this dragon's going to deny this dude. Runs him over and gets the flame wall up now. Could be a really good flame. Ah, oh, just a bit out of position. The three quads take it out. Scat's going down to V's from Moon Knight. There's a dragon uh, destroying here. That barracks is going to go down. Will the oil go down as well that Moon Knight's got? Not a lot of fire, but they're only two V's, so taking even longer to get rid of that dragon. And that Derek survives by the skin of its teeth. Commies and Gats coming in then from Hesso and Hummy here. In the north of the map. Big pop of quads, pop of quads. Ooh, <laughs> bit of a Fargo pop there. Oh no. Ammo wasted a load of quads. Quadzilla popped, Quadzilla dead. Oh dear. 
Not so good. <laughs> Ammo still collecting in the middle though, and this army's pressing on. Tovey's like, oh, and this poor little pilot dude, he goes down. Uh, no wraps, only the one wrap. Yeah, looking to go commies in the um, SO, uh, USA Air Force. Hmm. Commies coming in again. Hmm. Not very effective, though, from. Uh, got the countermeasures, stealth, and the rocket pods, so good. All powered up. I'm oppressing with his purple quads here, though. Trying to. Disrupt that eco. This oil still surviving. Look at that. There is a dragon wandering in here though from Hummy. More. Oh, those drones must have picked up that stealth Comanche. Hitting a freeze. Latency at 23. It's not too bad for five of us. Hummy's in the base though of Moon Knight. Going for the supply. Take it out. Nice. And they wander off to safety here. That's a good result for Ammo. He has stopped Hummy collecting there in the middle. Hummy's, um, he didn't press that advantage though. He didn't keep going, did he? I don't quite understand why not. Where did those um, commies go? Hmm. Oh, here they are. Esso's stealth Comanches. <laughs> Playing hide and seek. Oh, that's a good pop. Good pop from Ammo. That's not a good engagement to take. No, 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 no. Another. Oh dear, another blooper there. This time from Hesso. That was not a good engagement to take. I think he lost at least four. Commies there and big V army Tovies for Moon Knight. Military Kumi denied a tunnel there. This tunnel's really banged up as well. Is that oil still surviving? No, it's not. Dragon has made his way forward to this arty flat platform and it's parked up. Big push now from Moon Knight in the north of the map. Moon Knight and Ammo versus Hesso and Hummy. Team H, Hesso and Hummy. 1-0, one 1-0 one in the lead. Lotus gets taken out before she could capture that oil. Hmm. That's good play from... Moon Knight denying uh, Hummy that his uh, Lotus. This dragon's on the move now. He's woken up finally. Big engagement in the middle now. Hummy and Ammo set about it. Has he got no no armor piercing yet on these um, quads. Tommy goes down, another Comanche taken out of Hesos. Now, Moon Knight, I think he's going to get that oil, he's got it. Or, well, he could be sending a, a, one or two of these Chinooks to collect from there. Um, could Heso. Oh, he's after these Comanches. Heso's asleep with them as well. Loses another one. Hmm. Yeah, it's still a hard one to call, I think, at the moment. Could bring that dragon a little bit forward and start to deal out a bit more pain. Command center going up for ammo. I think Hesso's uh, struggling a little bit with those Comanches, honest opinion. Mig strike, no napalm. Loses two Migs, loses three Migs there, does Sammy. Take out that tunnel though. And he's on battle buses as well, ammo. Just saw a BB in and out of that tunnel. Big Tovey army, massive Tovey army for Moon Knight looking to press in now. The man, I, you know, be a bit risky to engage with only four Comanches there. The loses one. Well, it was five. Down to four now. And Moon Knight pushing in on Hesso's base. And here's Purple. Here's his teammate pressing Hummy here as well. 
There is a dragon and Mig's coming over from Hummy though, trying to help his teammate out. That's a nice Mig strike. And GG from Hummy. And GG from Hesso. Good game. You they bring it back to 1-1. One, one. Ammo and Moon Knight bring it back to 1-1. One, one. Get the score up. In this best of 11, so first to six will win the $100 challenge. Sponsored by, very con kindly sponsored by Pepsi. Put a bit of different music on as well. That volume's okay. Not too loud. In his orb selfie, do your job. <laughs> and the legend, GNX. Welcome. Yeah, yeah, I think so with Hesso with those Comanches was a big um Big point in that game. If he'd, I think if he'd microed them better, he lost a lot. Took on that in, in, one in particular, poor engagement, and lost a lot of commies. So now we've got the reverse on tournament eight. <sighs> so. Top right in gold, Hesso, USA, Vanilla, and um, his teammate in blue, bottom right, GLA Tox for Hummy. Opposite him in purple, China Vanilla for Ammo, and his teammate Moon Knight playing in red, USA Air Force. Interesting to see what Moon Knight goes for. Is he going to go War Factory or Airfields, Commies, Raps? Hmm. Those are immediately coming to this dock for ammo, by the looks of it, yeah. We could come into the middle for Hummy. Well, USA Vanilla will go War Factory barracks, wouldn't it? Hesse's still got his command center at the moment. Hummy sold his, as has ammo. Air Force has kept his, uh, uh, Moon Knight's kept his uh, uh, command center, which is pretty normal for airfield. First uh, airfield going up. So yeah, it's good to see him going airfield with Air Force. I like that. Final attempt going up here from Hummy. There's a dozer coming forward from Hesso as well. Team H. Worker coming to the very center of the oil refinery. Oh, look at this. So he's making a big play for these two oil derricks, isn't he? Barracks going up here, yeah. Moon Knight got a missile defender wandering around here. And ammo expanding to collect from these crates. Scat coming forward. I think this is going to be the first bit of engagement. Good laser lock from uh, Hesso there, but... Yeah, didn't work out. This dozer's blocking him well good. Look at that, nice. No, it still didn't enable the missile defender to get the laser lock on. This guy's trying to stop Hesso getting these oils, but not succeeded. Hesso's got both those oils. These oils haven't been captured yet. Comanche down from Moon Knight. Oh, is he going commies as well then? Two airfields up. Wow, he's only got one commie then, if that's the case. Interesting. Ammo's camped here on this barracks. He's taken out um, Hesso's dozer as well. Terrorist takes out the... Oh, man. That's painful. Oh, dear. Hesso's... No, it's not Hesso, is it? It's got to be... Um... Grief, man. Hummies. Terrorist made it all the way across here to take out that dozer of Moon Knight. That's crazy. That's forward. I like that forward tunnel as well from, uh, from Hummy. Really good. Comanche... Joining, Manchi's joining the Gatling tanks here, and he's pressing on 
into the um, getting ever closer to the base area of um, of Hummy. Not got the rocket pods yet. Stealthed and with the electric countermeasures. I mean, he's really pressing in on ammo though here at the moment, giving him some grief. No, sorry, Moon Knight. Well, it's ammo's gap, but he's close to Moon Knight's base, isn't he? Moon Knight using these Comanches pretty good at the moment, surviving and killing workers. Just leave the quads out, Hummy. Yeah, he's come north here as well. He needs to pop from here. Killing workers here as well, Galore. Hmm. Doing well with these Comanches. This is a lot better use of Comanches. Dragon clearing this building from ammo and he's got a firewall up there as well to try and keep Hummy away oh look at this ammo's into um Esther's base with a couple of gats took out a Chinook wow I'm gonna find those commies of Moon Knights look like they've disappeared somewhere I can't find them <laughs> Right, so, wow, Hesso's got those two, well, these two oils have been taken out, but Hesso's got the two oils on the north. The stealth Comanches are a pain in the bum. Try and keep an eye on, you can't see them. Now, Hesso's bringing up a load of Vs. I wonder if they're tow Vs. Again, we'll soon find out, won't we, guys? Hmm, Inferno Cannons. No Napalm upgrade on them though, for ammo. This is looking good for Team H. Pressing in on Moon Knight here. Oh, and here's those Comanches at it again from Moon Knight, wrecking this eco of Hummy here. Hmm, how many has he got there? Six Comanches now. Yeah, I can only click on them once they start to open up. Any other go? He's got the rocket pods as well now, so that's good. Esso coming back with all his Vs. Um, yeah, I, I don't know about that, to be honest. Opening up on the Stinger now. Loses two Comanches there. Hmm. We've got four. Killed all those workers. Well, he, no, he's playing well. Moon Knight's playing well. Ray's doing good with these Comanches. I think I've only seen him lose two. So, Hummy's collecting from the middle. And, and Ammo's collecting on the other st other side. He's um, losing more Comanches now, though. Oh, dear. Just two remaining. Vetted up, though. Bet three commie there needs to deal with this RPG. Oh, that was that was man, that was a waste. That last Comanche getting taken out. Bet two Comanche. Pilots fall into his doom. This is interesting. Has to swap to come and hit um, ammo here, bottom left. Brought all these V's over. They're tow V's, only tow V's. I think ammo's gonna be wide open though. There's still gonna be a lot of V's surviving here. Moon Knight coming in with uh, commies to try and help his playing partner out here. The uh, Esso retreating with these Vs, losing a lot of Vs as well. Rocket pods start to rip into these boys. And that's good use of those Chinooks as well with the point defense laser deflecting those rocket pods. Nice. That was well played. Good bit of XP there for um, Moon Knight, who's on level 2. All players on level 2 bar Hesso. Well behind. Next load of V's are here, but um, Purple People Eater, Mr. Ammo, is pressing on this north side. He's destroyed both these oils now. Has he got... He has got Napalm upgrade on those Infernos. Good. Search and destroy, Search and destroy up for Hesso. 
Mmm, and Hummy's cleared this eco. Carpet coming in. Surviving those Tovies. He's in a bad way, though. Will he get to drop his cargo? I think he will. Yep, yeah, here he goes. Carpet on. Hesso takes out the power, damages the strat center. Look at this. Hesso's in the base of Moonlight now with these Vs. And Hummy's helping as well with quads. Taking on this Gat army of ammos. Desperately trying to defend. A10 strike. <laughs> oh, the X hit. Split from Hesso, but still lost several Vs there from that Warthog strike. And only three Vs surviving. Yeah. There's artillery coming in now from ammo as well. As these surviving V stragglers get driven off. I think that's on this supply, you know. Yeah, on the tunnel in the supply stash. There's a carpet coming in as well from ammo. Try and finish it all off. Good carpet, man. Good combination. Excellent play there with that with the general's powers. Meanwhile, Ammo's pressing in to Hesso's base. Purple giving the EBGBs to Hesso. Turning the tables now, making Hesso defend. And Hummy's after him, trying to help his teammate out. Oh, there's Comanches here now from Moon Knight as well. This is looking dodgy for Hesso. Really dodgy. This is a Comanche. That Stinger site perched up there was uh, dealing a bit of pain out, but man, yeah, this is bad. That's a Vet 3 and a Vet 2 Comanche make their way out of there. Well, you know, ammo's clearing the middle as well with these Inferno cannons. Blue getting pushed back. I mean, in a spot of bother. These two gats just parked up. I mean, he's going to clear them up now. He's just parked up, parked them up here to um, harass any sh uh, Chinooks trying to get in to co collect. But, and here's ammo pressing here as well. Going to be denying tunnels. Manchie's going about their business. More of them now, and these Infernos clearing the middle as well, with the commies hitting from the air. This is looking good for Ammo and Moon Knight now. Expanded to collect from this big dock. Load of supplies still left here. Yeah, you want to hold here. You want to keep those get up. Well, hmm. Here comes Moon Knight with... And the GG from Hesso. Hummy's left on his own. So, we got Tox. Tox on power now, haven't we? Hmm. I mean, there's a lot left. Yeah, this is where... Hmm, I'm not going to say anything. <laughs> but you know what I mean, guys. You know what I'm hinting at. <laughs> Spectre gunship in from Moon Knight then on the base of Hummy. Going for the production, the arms dealer and the supply stash. Still a good number of, of supplies here. Takes the arms dealer out. There's a big army here though from... Uh, massive army here from... And a GG from Hummy, yeah, I was just about to say. Yeah. You have been defeated. So, ammo and Moon Knight. Moon Knight take game number three. Get the score up. Go into a 2-1 lead now after losing the first game. Well played, guys. Welcome, Dark Knight and Collins. Hey, hey, Habash. Welcome. Good to see you here. <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Falcon are getting chosen now. Oh, that's a shame. Colin, Collins has to leave us. Goodbye. Thank you for joining us for the time you were. 
Right, game number four coming up on Volcano. Oh. To go up, so I was looking at chat. Ooh. Air Force and China's. USA and China's. Wow, it's a good matchup between these two teams. They're pretty evenly matched, I think, from what we're seeing at the moment. Just need a second. Right, I'm back. I let the guys know. Oh, 25 viewers on this glorious Saturday afternoon here in the UK. Beautiful weather. I hope you've got great weather wherever you are, guys. So, I've got two tanks, a USA and a USA Air Force. I mean, look at that. USA Vanilla and USA Air Force versus two tanks. Wow. Hmm, that's a bit of an imbalance in it, guys. Favorable for the USA armies, I'd say. Oh, I still... Why not going in at OBS? I thought I'd already hit OBS. senile in my old age guys <laughs> top left hummy usa vanilla and his teammate in gold usa air force for esso opposite him facing him his opponent in purple china tank for ammo and moon knight china tank in red so yeah i think um ammo and moon knight are both from the uk as well you know Immediately sending a doozer uh, forward to these crates on the right hand side. You've got a safe dock immediately behind. A lot of crates here with two RT platforms. Ammo doing the same going forward to these crates himself. There's an oil derrick here. Two RT platforms here. A lot of crates here on this left hand side and a tech repair bay. I don't think that ever gets captured, you know. I don't know if I've ever seen it captured in a game. <laughs> Supply War Factory barracks up for Hummy. Forward barracks for Esso here. In War Factory. No airfield for the Air Force General at the moment. It's a decent placement, that supply center, and he's got a war forward war factory here as well. Sending a dozer. Looks like he'll look to collect there. No drops coming in from the, from the USA's. Hmm, interesting. First V then comes forward from the blue player, Hummy. Good micro, nice, I like that. Wow, that popped open real easy, didn't it? He's after this tank hunter. Ambo comes to join the party for Hummy. And Hasso's pressing 
his opponent. Ammo on the right hand side. Good laser lock. But he's losing those missile defenders. Two remain. And this excellent micro from Hummy continues. Takes out another gap. Yeah, this is what you can get, isn't it? With uh, USA versus China tank. If someone's on the ball with their micro Vs stacked with missile defenders. Ammo's faring better against Hesse on the other side, but Moon Knight's in trouble here. There's two Vs here now. Where's the Ambo? Oh, it's behind the rock, I think. Well, it was inside the rock. <laughs> Did you see that, guys? That's the magic trick. <laughs> oh, dear. Mm. Yeah. I mean, not even on the three-minute mark. It's looking bad for the China tank armies, isn't it? Although, Ammo is pressing Hesso here. Very different to what's happening to his teammate. Bottom left. Yeah, this is looking desperate now for Moon Knight. Yeah, he's got the, only the, the remaining war factory here. He's going to be hunted here now as well. That dozer's gone. Pretty sure of that. Ammo's pressing Hesso here. Continues to press. Playing well against the, um, the Air Force General. But Moon Knight is kaput, as they say in Germany. Goes. Done a decent job there now, though. The last building. No, he's got a dozer. He's not hunted, actually. Getting a power up here is Moon Knight. <laughs> But no red left in its original base area for Moon Knight bottom left. Moon Knight defeated. No GG there. I mean, this is game for Team H. Hummy and Hesso. Been great micro from Hummy. A lesson out of micro those Vs. Well played. The player from the Netherlands. I do believe he's a Dutchman, isn't he? From the Netherlands. Oh, mix out from Ammo. Interesting. A little too late. I mean, he did take a V out there. GG from Ammo. Oops, wrong button. You have been defeated. <sighs> so, Hummy and Hesso bring it back to 2-2. Two -two. Yeah, it would be interesting to see how easy or not Ammo and Moon Knight make of it with the uh, USA armies this time around, isn't it, guys? Uh, Mrs. Alfie Ace with my cup of tea. Thank you very much. And my little dog's come up. Little Jasper, he's behaving himself at the moment today. He's not, uh... Not been barking. Are you a mad the dog sound effects coming in yet today? That's good. Yeah, that's what happened there. Last drop. Good V micro. Got those um, Vs vested up. That's for sure. We go then next game game number five in this best of 11 first to six at two two so top left usa vanilla for moon knight also known as wraith and his teammate usa air force general malcolm ace granger in purple opposite him his opponent direct opponent in gold china tank for hesso and to the left china tank in blue for hummy Hummeister, teammate against Ammo and Moon Knight. Again, this is a tall order, isn't it, guys? 
P3 to to um ammo Moon Knight. We'll see how it goes. Barracks War Factory going up. Yeah, there's gonna be a drop coming in from ammo here. Up quite a few missile defenders there. Barracks War Factory going up for uh, Moon Knight. Ammo's dropping on Hummy. Hmm, that would be a good place, yeah. We'll lock in on that. Where's he going with the missile defenders? I mean, decided against continuing with that scaffold. There, no lock in, perhaps out of distance, and Ammo's dropped a doser right on Hesso's base. Missile defender setting about the war factory now. There is a gap trying to get it come across. Needs a good laser lock from ammo. He's got it. Loses one missile defender, but two missile defenders continue to survive. And there's a gat on this dozer of ammo. So, yeah, this is all a bit of nothing. Well. Oh, there's a V coming in from Moon Knight. That's good. The combination here. The V and the missile defenders from... Ammo hitting this war factory now. Looks like Kesso got one of Ammo's Vs though there. So that's good. But um Let me try to finish off the dozer. It's the trouble with gats, isn't it? Against anything that's not air and infantry, not so good. Laser lock from Moon Knight on the GAT, take it out. So trying to help his teammate out, but he's going to lose a gat as well. And then the dozer's down from Moon Knight here. Esso's pressing though. He's trying to press in on Ammo, his opponent. Yeah. Well, they're not doing too bad so far. I mean, they're not on the three minute mark. Yeah, but ah, that's too easy sometimes for the V's on the gats, isn't it? Look at that. Dealing with these missile defenders, good. Two Vs and an Ambo coming in from Ammo. Yeah, it'll be interesting to see what his micro is is like compared to what Hummy was like in the first game. Hummy's trying to press with three Gats here. Yeah. Ooh, prop center up then for Hesso. ECM out. It's made short work up. Though he has disabled that V and he gets it. Hesso gets it. Good result. Now, Hummy pressing with Red Guard and Gats. I think um, Team H are doing pretty good here, all things considered. The armies they're against, guys. Look at this. Another ECM joins his Gats to try and press in on ammo. Moon Knight's doing well here, though. It's that push from I make another gat down. Needs a prop center himself, doesn't he? Another troop crawler pops with gats. Just got the war factory supply, and yeah, looking a bit desperate now for Hummy. He took out one truck there. But look at this. Hesso's in on ammo. Destroys that dozer. Where's his other dozer then? Is he hunted? Oh, I think he might be hunted. Wow. Down to 1v here as well is the purple player, Ammo. Beacon placed by Hummy. An interesting combination here. Hesso and Hummy teaming up. ECM comes in to help his teammate. Wow. They're not going to do it, are they? Tank beating the two USAs. That would be something, wouldn't it? Still an ECM with these two gats, and Hesso harassing these Chinooks now. Needs to get that ECM closer to these two um, gats. They're just getting slaughtered here. Yeah, it's not so good. Mm-hmm. Can harass more this Chinook. This Chinook's vulnerable. Moon Knight. Ooh, his teammate's out. Ammo's quit out. Though Hesso on his own. 
as Air Force and Vanilla USA to deal with Team H. Migs out now. That's great. Great strike. Take out two Vs. Do you know, guys, I think they're going to do it. And the GG from Moon Knight. Oh, my goodness me. You have been defeated. Well played, Hesso and Hummy. Can you believe that? Can you believe that, guys? They go in to a 3-2 lead. Round of applause for that one. That's going to sting. Ouch. <laughs> oh, dear. <sighs> it's that buck abuse shooting from rocks. No, it's a magician's trick. It's a Matt, it's Gandalf. Gandalf in zero hour. <laughs> oh dear man. I don't know if I've ever seen that before in zero hour. It's amazing what the game keeps throwing up, isn't it? Uh, yeah. Right, I'm going to put a bit of China music on, I think. Oh, but, well, there's no China armies. Put a bit of GLA on, eh? Yeah. Right, we're on... Coastline world? <laughs> Sounds like always reminds me of coastline mold or something like this. GLA GLA demo against USA and GLA. USA laser. Interesting. Hmm. Hmm. So Bottom left, GLA Vanilla for ammo in purple. Top left, his teammate Moon Knight, USA Laser, General Pinpoint Towns. Opposite him in blue, GLA Demo and General Rod Hall Juhis. Demo Juhis. Full name. Bottom right in gold, GLA Vanilla for Hesso. So, two GLA armies, Demo and Vanilla, face off against. GLA Vanilla and the USA Laser Army of Moon Knight. Yeah, big map this. As they often are, 2v2s, forward crates here for Moon Knight. You've got banged up oil derrick here. Refinery in the middle, oil derrick here. And this oil derrick on the island at the bottom, and you've got the opposite top right for Hummy to go for, perhaps. Setting up his box and collecting here. Nice box. LA workers congregated in the middle. Purple and gold. Ammo against Hesso, who's forward collecting off these crates and collecting off his main dock, of course. Those are coming forward looking for a crush from Moon Knight. Could get this dude. He's not really paying attention to him at the moment, though. Nice box here from Moon Knight as USA Laser. First V out. And that worker's hidden away in the grass hut. Trying to survive. Yeah. So there's a tech charging in from ammo on Hummy. 
Look, he's just doing a bit of scouting. And he's occupied that building, that's good. Oh, let's look a bit of action there. I mean, he drops a terrorist and something got taken out here. He's lost. Whoa, he's done a. He got a dozer then, didn't he? Wow. And ammo is in on Hummies supply and eco harassing killing workers. That looked like a good early result there for Hummy doing some death and destruction on Ammo's base area. This tech is running for his life for Ammo. There's a worker here. It's grenade tech there for Ammo as well. Somehow that tech of Hummies survived. Oil derricks booby trapped with a bomb there. Hmm, interesting. Hummy harassing Moon Knight here with RPG drop with the tech. Moon Knight's on it and clears it up. X everywhere, isn't it, guys? With three GLA armies. Solitary USA laser. That oil grabbed that as they was trying to get on there. It did ammo. That's good. Hummy's in here again. Going for the supply center. He gets it. Good play. Well played, Hummy. Nice. He's really been playing well in this game as GLA. Really has been. Collecting off this supply then. And he's got this oil as well. Ammo's captured his oil here. Mm, looks like that worker taken out in that grass hut by the V's of Moon Knight. Comes to face with Ammo's face to face with Ammo's Tex here. Oh, that's his teammate. <laughs> Ooh, it all gets a bit confusing sometimes. <laughs> yeah. Oh, that's well, good pop from Esso there with the RPGs. But there is a grenade tech here for ammo. We'll make sure, make mincemeat of those. Uh, oh, look at that. Two shots. Killed all those RPGs. They're playing well together here at the USA and GLA Army. Army has managed to capture that oil now. And they've split. The two armies have Hesso and ammo. Ammo is looking to destroy that oil, just take it out. Well, I mean, whoa, he took out that demo trap, so that was good. That worked out well. Search and destroy. There is a worker still alive here, though. Look at that. He's, yeah, he's going to get try and attempt to get the tunnel up there. There's search and destroy in play for Moon Knight. Buggies. Buggies out for Hesso as well. They walk straight into those... Oh man, walk straight into those V's. Oh dear, painful. Expensive as well. So, Demo Rider out. Goes down. I mean, he didn't have any success with that. First attempt. And these V's finish off that oil, Derek. Again, the buggies. Oh, saved one. Oh, nice TT hit on the tunnel. From Ammo takes it out. They're playing well in this game. So this oil has been captured by Ammo now. Wow. That's recaptured, isn't it? Didn't I thought um Ami had that originally? Still a good amount in here. There is a palace up for Esso. Of course, we've seen the buggies already. Oh man, look at the size of this V army. If they've got missile defenders in, that's going to be massive. Jarman snipes this Vet 3 tech. That might have been a super tech as well. Hmm. Looking bad for Team H at the moment. This is a combination and half. There's a battle bus in the mix with this as well. 
I mean, the Jarman's up to his deeds for um, Hesso, but this is a monster army. Oh, my goodness me. All hands to the pump here. Here we go. Look out. Take cover. Purple and red pressing in big style on Hesso and Hummy. Hess, Hummy facing the uh, brunt of it here at the moment. Collins was telling me that that alarm sound <laughs> made his wife jump once. <laughs> Frighten the living daylights out of her. This oil is still surviving for Hummy. That's good. Battle bus is sniped. This tech would be a good one to recapture. Look at these two Jarman together. I think that's um, Hesso and Hummy's Jarman teammates. Nice pop. Wants to get those missile defenders back in though, especially with Jarman around. Gonna snuffle these dudes out. There you go. What I tell you. Still looking really good for Moon Knight and Ammo though. That's to say. Is for them to lose, isn't it? Palace up for ammo and black markets as well. Nice. Diamond sniping as a beacon placed by Moon Knight here. Yeah, there's some sniped vehicles that could do with getting retaken. Drone getting taken out there. And the buggies beefed up with that 50% rocket increase. Ammo pops with his own buggies, hits Esso's boogie boys. Ooh, scud attempt going up from Esso. Don't have one from Hummy. More black markets for ammo. Drop zone there, second drop zone attempt going up there. A bit of a lull in the game now. I shall take a mouthful of my cup of tea. Welcome, Kimur. Let me go for the oil. He gets it. Nice. Takes that oil out. Somehow got in there with these, you know, protected by these tunnels, and he still got in. And I got the refinery. Saves 10% on your units, which is good. That really does add up. Now, Esso and Hummy pressing. There's a battle bus out for. Hummy here as well. Being targeted by the buggies of ammo. Takes it out. The Jarman are right in the thick of things in the front here. For both players. Oh. One of them lost their Jarman to ammo there though. I haven't seen a Jarman for ammo yet. He must have had one out at some point. Yeah, I mean these Vs aren't doing a great deal for Moon Knight at the moment, are they? They're just wandering around looking pretty. Um, should be able to, yeah. Hmm. Moving in now on Hesso's base here. Bit, bit over hesitant, I think. I mean, that's a lot of firepower. Those Vs. I mean, they're going to draw the attention of buggies before long, surely, if they don't. <sighs> yeah. All players level level two bar Moon Knight, who's still level one. Scud is up for Hesso. There's another Jarman here, sniping. Yeah, I think that's perhaps Hesso's. Not sure. It's either Hummies or Hesso that Jarman is hiding behind the. Oh, put a bomb. That's a demo then, so I'd say that's Hummies. Jarman. Demo trap in the middle here. Ramo. Nice. Oh, 
Oh, he's got a lot of black markets. Look at this. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Building the ninth black market. And now is ammo. Huge eco. Scud is just under four minutes out. Airfield up for Moon Knight. Hmm, interesting. All right. It's three drop zones now for Moon Knight. His buggy's looking to move in. Jarman in the mix. Bahami again there. Second scud going up for. Oh, excuse me. But has so, and there's a particle up for Moon Knight as well. At two Jarman. Been beaconed here for, and um, that's Hummy's Jarman. Yeah, I thought it was a matter of time. He's killing workers now. Moon Knight trying to move in and ambush these buggies. He's in, but there is a bus here from, uh, whose bus is that? It's Hesso's. Wow. Oh my goodness me. Look at the state of that. Moon Knight losing tons of Vs. Oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Not so good. Every V taken out there by Team H. That is a bit of a bummer. And the buggy survived to con continue to whack away on ammo. Oh, walked onto the demo trap there though did Moon Knight I believe. Rider out here for one of these players on the uh, that would be ammo. Then is he looking for power? No, can't be saboteur on the scud. Yeah, look at this resets the scud. Nice, classy. <laughs> the ominous laugh of the saboteur. Well played, ammo. Thinking outside the box there, and there's Burton on the battlefield. Watch out, watch out, there's Burton about. Getting in amongst these buggies of uh, Hesso's. Didn't. Going after Hummy's buggies now. Needs to watch out. Low health. Does take out two of Hummy's buggies. So where's that particle then? Here it is, all the way back here. Yeah, four drop zones now for Moon Knight. All players level two, bar Hummy on level three. Jarman cozied up to Burton here, and he's in a bad way. That's Ammo's. Nice, commies on these buggies. That's Ammo's Jarman there, I do believe. Throw those buggies off from Moon Knight. Nearly mined out here. This oil's gone. That ammo had. And that oil's been taken out as well. That Hummy had. So both all the oils are gone. Refinery's gone in the middle. <laughs> in the middle as well. Some game this. Three scuds up now for Esso. Scud up for Hummy. Two particles up for Moon Knight. First particle will be going soon for Wraith. Clears that demo with the commies. Nice. Well, Ammo's got massive eco, putting up Scud Storms galore as well now. So many black markets. Hmm. It's a lot of buggies. Oh. Why didn't that that demo? Oh, Jarman on a, <laughs> it's a Jarman on a on a bike. The famous Jarman on a bike. Um, that's I'd say that's Hesso. It might be wrong though. He can placed by ammo. Oh, and here we have the particle coming in on black markets. Nice. 
That's good. That's two black markets down. Three. Going for the fourth. Not going to get it. Three black markets taken out by that particle. That's really good. It's a lot of money being taken away. For, um... I heard something going on then. Oh, it was a Jarman in here. Yeah, I heard buggies firing. Of course, I'm not exactly sure what that was all about, but a Jarman taken out there. Now we have a big push from both players. Team H, Hesso and Hummy pushing here at the top of the map. Ammo pops with buggies to counter. Oh, demo! Well, that was an ambush, whatever it was. Great ambush on those buggies of ammos. Reset that army. Ay, caramba. Now, all of a sudden, this is starting to look really good. There's another particle ready to go for Moon Knight, but this is looking pretty decent for Team H at the moment. Big battle going on here now between these two teams. The particle's not fired yet from Moon Knight. Two armies, two armies continue to battle and rage. There's still a combination of gold and blue taking on ammo here. And the particles going again, going for black markets. It's taken out at least two. It's done damage to the... Only not much, though. A little bit of damage there. To the Scud. Moon Knight sells up that supply center, which wasn't collecting anywhere anyway. Now these Warthogs coming in, three A-10s looking for, for some carnage. Be on the uh, Scud, isn't it? Yeah. Whoa, nearly take it out. There is a worker here repairing, or there was. Needs another hit. Needs something to come in and finish a job off here. This Scud's ready to rumble. Let's follow this baby in, incoming from... From Hesso, it's in on um, Moon Knight, isn't it? Going for supply uh, drop zones, yeah. Hitting the power, took out his drop zone. Oh, that's a big hit. War Factory supply center. Gun. Oh my goodness. Whoa, 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 whoa. All those combat, all those Chinooks, sorry, going down. That was a massive hit from Hesso. What a hit that was. Good grief, and another one comes in as well. Scud to the face of Moon Knight. He's getting it big style. Oh, grief. Pain upon pain. Comiso pressing on the north here for Moon Knight. And Ammo's coming in with a ground army here as well. No tunnel right at the back here for uh, Hummy could do with it. They've made their way to the back and are hitting, taking out the black market now. And the demo riders. Good use of these commies. Continue for our, um, Moon Knight. There's a, they're vetting up as well. Buggies and commies working to de together with quads. There's that demo trap, does Moon Knight. Not on the super weapon front. Mm. Still a, a bit of a way to go yet. Yeah, all players level four. No one level five yet. Who's the closest? Hesso. Yeah. Hesso's near enough there. Needs another good engagement. He'll be level five. We know what that brings for the GLA generals. Oh, this is good combination, these two. Moon Knight and Ammo playing really well with the commies and the ground force. Purple and red. But he is losing Comanche's Moon Knight. Down to just the one now. Really pushing Hummy and Hesso back. What a game. This is a really good game, this game. 21 minutes into this game then. 16 seconds before 
Uh, Hummy fires his next. Oh, another ambush on this army of ammos. Resets it near enough. Just two quads survive. Getting picked off by these buggies now. We've got the particle ready to go from Moon Knight. Here it is. She's going to let rip. Is that going to be on Hesso again? Probably. I don't know. There's a scud from ammo ready to go as well. Here we go. Ah, oh, the scud's going to come in here to try and take these two scuds of Hesso's out. Particle doing its best to damage these two scuds as much as possible. Now the scud from ammo is going to be coming in. Here it comes. One scud down to the hole. Oh, wow. Look at that. Massive hit. Well played. Well played. The two players on the left. Ammo and Moon Knight. Combination of the particle and the scud. Destroy those two scuds of um, Hesso's. Now they've only got a scud each of Hesso and um, Hummy. Game swinging massive towards four Ammo and um, Moon Knight now. That's for sure in this game. Game number six. There's a Tox Bomb coming in from Hummy though. Big Tox Bomb. Oh, these quads getting taken out. And this last solitary quad gets taken care of. So, Ammo level five. Hesso five. Hummy level five. Moon Knight still level four. Way back on HP actually is Moon Knight. Yeah. A10's coming in again from Moon Knight. There is another particle ready to go. Where is it? It's on the scud, and the A10 is going to be coming in on this. This could be. Oh, it's only got 45 seconds. There's a worker desperately trying to. Oh, keep it going, but it's out. It's gone. That's great play again by Hesso. Uh, sorry, uh, Moon Knight and um, Moon Knight and Ammo. There is a sneak attack here from Hemi now. Big moment, but look at this. My goodness, wow, this huge purple army comes to snuff this sneak out. That's not going to come the much. Yeah, nothing really went with that one. So, yeah, this is surely game now for um, Ammo and Moon Knight. I mean, Hesso hasn't got many black markets at all. What, two, three, four, four surviving black markets. There is a scud ready to go for ammo in 45 seconds. 33 seconds for um for Hummy's next scud. Battle bus pops out of the arms dealer. Now ammo's looking to come in here big style on Hummy. Oh my goodness, walked into that tunnel though. Look at that. Whoa man, lost every. Oh but this Tox bomb. Doesn't drop. Doesn't make it. No. I thought he was going to drop it there. Bait him out a bit. Didn't work that way, did it? Okay. Where did um, Hummy fire then? Is he on? Well, Moon Knight's base is a bit wrecked now. <laughs> well, ammo is monstrous and he's got a scud ready to go. I'm not sure which one it is. There's a Tox Bomb dropped here by one of the Team H armies. It's got to be, um, well, they're both. There's a Sneak as well. Where's the Sneak? Where is that Sneak? I don't know. Scud's still not fired from ammo. Hmm. I definitely heard a Sneak then. I don't know where on earth it was. Not sure why ammo hasn't fired that scud yet. Here we go. Let's follow this baby in. On her mate. On the scud and a particle hitting it at the same time as well. Taking out Hummy's last scud storm. That's good. Yeah, this is game. Hummy's pressing here, but can't see a way through now for 
gold and blue. It's just, yeah, I mean, that's a good ambush there. It took out all those quads of ammo, but uh, even so, he's so massive with so many black markets, isn't he? Now there is a sneak attack from Hummy here, right in the middle of the base. Pick out a power of Moon Knights. Wow, you'd think this is the last throw of the dice, wouldn't you guys? Going down. GG from Hummy. Yeah, as I thought. You have Ammo been and Moon Knight take it in what was a really good game. 27 minutes. Well played, guys. They bring it back now to 3-3. Three, three. Oh. Okay. I'm just going to have a short... Well, I'll let the guys get the armies first, and I'm going to have a... Oh, it's just the reverse, isn't it? Right back. Yeah, just going to have a short break. Guys, I'll be back with you soon. Right, I'm back, guys. Let's get me headphones on. Let them know I'm back. And in as obs. Your next says, Alfie, calm down, dude. You can't stay calm when zero hours kicking off, mate. Get excited, get a uh, into the flow. <laughs> so get to accept Heso and Hummy, GLA and USA against GLA. And 
Jim made them at home. Well, we'll be right back. <laughs> so in chat, what are you doing there, mate? Should be in the game. <laughs> and Mr. Mazun joins us. Welcome. It's a close one, isn't it, guys? Pepsi's certainly getting his money's worth as a sponsor. $100 on this set. $50, $50 each to the winner. Nice. Excellent game paid for a game you love to play, isn't it? And Mr. Hesso accepts. Hurrah! <laughs> Here we go, then. 3-3, three, three, the reverse on this map. Bottom left then in gold, China Vanilla for Hesso and his teammate, Hummy. USA Vanilla. Top left. Opposite him in red, GLA Demo for Moon Knight. And playing in purple, purple, his teammate Ammo, GLA Vanilla. Immediately, as per the normal meta, workers streaming forward. Arms, are, legs are pumping, arms are swinging. Panting away, gulping in that oxygen as they run to their master. So sending worker north to his teammate's base to tunnel and I'm going for a drop. Interesting. Coming in on uh, ammo by the looks of it. Follow this Chinook in. Tunnel's going up for ammo, of course. But ammo's on it. Look how he's got his workers out there. Saved every one of them. Not going to happen for Hummy there at the moment. Yeah. Looking for... Looking for some victims. Ooh, it's close, but Ammo has responded well with those workers. There's a tech coming over to try and save them now. Drops RPGs. That's good play from Ammo. Driving off that Chinook. Excellent play there. The V in the middle for Hummy now. Ooh, combat cycle flying out. Revving up. Nice hit there from Moon Knight. Take out that supply center. Excellent. And that Chinook's back. Dropping the dozer here on ammo, killing workers. Well, did he? I think ammo saved all his workers again. That quad's going to take out that nuisance of um, a dozer there. Nice. So, Hesso's expanded to collect from this dock. He's captured this oil early as well. That's good. Moon Knight's not captured that oil yet. Two techs roaming. Gonna deny, um... That would have been Hummy trying to get that oil, I reckon. Oil capture here by ammo. These two techs are... Pressing on in, though, from uh, Moon Knight here. He drops a worker there and occupies the tower. That's good. Ammo's going for this oil. Yeah. Oh, and Moon Knight's in, killing workers. That's good. Oh, and crushing RPGs. Man. Took out a load of RPGs there as well, did Moon Knight. Well played. Hmm. TT hit. Yes, nice. Takes out the tunnel. Now these units move in from her so. Oh, wow, look at this. Aye, Moon Knight camps on Hummy's eco, took out a Chinook. 
SO is looking, they got to deal with this. Me hitting with V's here in the middle. Coming up with quads as well. That's a lot of RPGs, isn't it? Crush getting on there from Hummy. Still RPG surviving, mind you. That's a Vet 3 um, tech as well. I don't know if it's a super tech. It's at least a grenade tech. Picks up more scrap there also. Grief, man. Oh, is he going to lose another Chinook? This is a real nuisance for Hummy. It's really good play from Moon Knight. I have to say. Don't... Just... Why didn't you just stay there, man? Just stay where you were. No. Oh, it's going so well until then. Oh, that was a waste. Should have just camped and stayed there. But look at this forward tunnel from Moon Knight. A load of techs combined for purple and reds. Ammo and Moon Knight now pressing in on um, Hesso's base. He's losing. They're both losing a lot though here to quads. Yeah, that ain't gonna work out too well, is it? Really? You got a ranger drop on this tower as well from Hummy. That's good. Looking to clear out this aggressive tunnel. It's got to be dealt with. Hmm. Yeah. Still surviving though that tunnel. The ranger opening up on it. Got to clear that though. It's got to be dealt with. Beacon placed by Hesso here. Hesso moving in on this area of ammos with his own quads. Oh, look at this. Grief, man. Moon Knight is really playing well at the moment. He's got a tunnel in here. Look at that. And he's trying to get another one here. Occupied this building. Real thorn in the backside for Hesso here. Demo bikes trying to get a grips with these V's. No. Hummy played well there. Defended strong. That's good. This second tunnel's going to get up though. And he's going to occupy this building with more RPGs is um, Moon Knight. And more firepower. And he's repairing the building. Hummy's coming to try and clear it. Esso coming in with a tech here. Let me take care of that tunnel. He starts to occupy buildings. Oh, look at this. Esso's going for the oil. Take this oil out. The ammo has. Or is he? Just parked up. What does that mean? If you can click on it. It means... I don't know. It's either empty or not in it. I'm not sure. Esso and... Um, I'm clearing this up though, where Mo uh, Moon Knight occupied. Oh, this could be big. Grief, man. Decent hit there with those demo bikes, but um, gold and blue are clearing. And yeah, it was a TT hit on uh, Ammo's Oil there from Hesso. That's good. Hesso still got this oil. And they have cleared here as well. Look at the state of that building. <laughs> Okay, so I mean long distance collecting off these crates as well. I heard combat cycles then again. Yeah. Moon Knight pumping out the demo bike riders going for the V's. Oh, take one. I mean, he's doing well though, only lost one V to three demo bikes. They're not cheap, you know, demo bikes. Can't really throw them away like confetti. Some guys do, but. So, ammo still on that oil. I'm still collecting forward off this dock. It's Hummy, isn't it? Who's got the low eco. It's a struggle for the USA. Buggy's out for ammo now as well. And there. Kept up. The upgrade. The buggy upgrade. <laughs> Need to somehow try and get rid of that oil. Ammo's on. Doing pretty good with these um, V's at the moment. But. Buggies and V's. We know how that goes, don't we, guys? This V's just walking into trouble. 
suicide it. can see the tactic they're going ammo and moonlight in it demo bikes and buggies at the moment still 3v surviving for Hummy here and a couple of buggies and moonlight along for the ride pushing trying to push ammo back to three black markets for for um and think Alfie come on Hesso well Hesso uh, you have to say Hummy's dealing pretty good with um the demo bikes of Moon Knight he's gunning down this oil refinery now Bucky's trying to hit away at these defenses around this oil that Ammo's got yeah, they want to clear him from this position. It'll be difficult though. Especially when you got demo bikes coming in on your backside as well all the time. Ouch. Ooh. These missile defenders. GG from Hesso. Wow. And GG from Hummy. You have well, I thought they called that. I don't know. Let's mark the score up before I forget. Um, Ammo and Moon Knight take it, move into a 4-3 lead. I thought there was more in that game. What do you think, guys? I, I mean, yeah. Ammo and Moon Knight in front, but... Well, Hummy was just no eco, wasn't he? It, it was, again, it was a case of the GLA. Um, having the better eco on that map. Really tough for USA. So the barbarian make make game number eight will be coming up once they get their armies guys have a little chat Ooh, China inf but team H I Well, we'll get some China music on. The old China. <laughs> yeah. So, Hesso and Hummy, both with China infantry against China and USA super weapon. Wow, what a matchup this is. Crazy matchup. Well, you'd say the Imp surely has got the advantage on, on this map, wouldn't you? I mean, anyway, whatever map, ain't Super Weapon in China, um, you'd think so, wouldn't you? A lot of money on this map, uh, a lot of golden stars as well on Make Make. Well, it'll be interesting. I mean, I played a guy just today, a China Inf. I went three Inf helixes and smashed him. <laughs> but I'm rubbish. I only play it <laughs> when you look at my game uh, room description. It's low skill level only, capital letters. I shout it. <laughs> so, but it worked. So, that was the joy of it. It actually worked. Poor chap.
Oh, look at that. Part of the command center has had a bite taken out of it. Moon Knight's got hungry. Anyway. <laughs> Top right in red, we have Moon Knight, Moon Knight, USA Super Weapon, General Alexis Alexander, the blonde bombshell, and his teammate in purple, China Vanilla. Bottom right in blue, China Inf for Hummy, and in gold, China Inf also for Hesso. Team H against Ammo and Moon Knight. They find themselves 4 3 down at the moment, so you've got an oil derrick in the back here. Safe supply dock there. A lot of crates there. Dock which Hummy's going for, of course. Pla RT platform crates here. Oil. And you've got two oils here. It's very easy to shoot across at each other. Crates and a lot of crates there. Dock at the top. And dock opposite. Drop coming in from the red player, Moon Knight. Also known as Wraith. Mm-hmm. Where's this boy going? It's like he's going in... Mm, yeah, he's swinging more towards Hesso's base now. Yeah, that Chinook's away. That's a good crush, though, from Hesso. Nice. Whoa, that all came to nothing rather quick, didn't it? Although... Moon Knight's dropped the dozer here and is going for a barracks. But the licks is going to be on it. Inflicts loaded up. Hey, he's been watching my tactics, hasn't he? Uh, wh why is he not going on that barracks then to take it out? Oh, I, mm, no, I don't know about that. I don't know about that, you. Makes out for ammo by the looks of it. Hitting this bunker straight away as um, Hummy's looking to expand. This inflict Lex now is going in on the super weapon general. Moon Knight's got to deal with this baby. That would have been good if that EMP could have got up. Not going to happen though. He's going to deny this oil as well. Moon Knight of course has got that barracks up and is putting out infantry which is a real pain in the butt for um Hesso. Oh, and the Migs, the Migs drops right on a gat. Yeah. And I'll go back to that supply center, carry on hitting that while the gats are trying to ex escape then. Crushing with the dozer on the mini gunners of Hesso. What a nuisance. Yeah, I don't know, man. Should he have gone and cleared that first or not? Anyway, ammo clears up that from Hesso. Mig strike on an outpost trying to press in from Hame here. I most dealt with that. I mean, he's looking to capture that oil though. Collecting here as well. Sending forward Red God to catch this RT platform perhaps. And look at this dozer still surviving. That's crazy. All this time that dozer's still surviving. Moon Knight sells up the barracks and this dozer's trying to escape. Hmm, Hesso's expanded to collect here. War factory up there. A lot of blue on the map. Whoa, look at this. Hummy's got both the oils in the middle as well. It's going to be crazy early eco then for the player in blue. Ah, and there's an airfield. Of course there's an airfield up for Hesso. Wow. Okay. Chinook coming in again here from Moon Knight and drops. Popped out here. Missile defenders on the outpost. Hmm. Chinook goes down. It's not really worked out that great for Moon Knight, I have to say. Good bunker there from Mamo. Migs hovering. Don't unleash their payload yet. Mamo's Migs. Well, they've got to be careful with Inf. Inf minigunners, isn't it? Grief. 
nice strike there on these infantry units and the escapes as well that solitary mig these two migs coming north moon knight pressing in with an outpost but so and sorry um, moon knight and ammo are on it a lot of inf survived that strike though hmm Moon Knight's not got a lot, has he? Building-wise. What, barracks? And is he hunt he's hunted as well, isn't he? <sighs> it's in a terrible way. I mean, he's got an oil, but... The only building to produce offensive units is his barracks. What on earth has happened here? I'm not coming across to defend his teammate, but... Surely this is all over already. The size of Hummy as well. A three minigun are opening up on these missile defenders. Hummy's got his own mix. Trying to capture ammo's supply center that's crushed from the trucks though not gonna allow that to happen whoa minigunner survives goes down finally <laughs> this is a surviving uh, tank hunter here for Hesso as well well I don't understand what happened to um, Moon Knight there I, I missed that obviously that's a uh, how me capturing this um, reinforcement pad and look at this Hesso hitting the barracks with his MiGs oh sorry um, yeah Hesso that's right well he's only got GG from ammo yeah you have been defeated team H take it I'm not surprised as China Inf against, you know, China Vanilla and USA Super Weapon. Uh, let's get the score up. They bring it back to 4-4. Going neck and neck, these two teams. Very evenly matched, aren't they, guys? It's the best of 11, so first to six. Both teams two, two games away from winning the set. Got the reverse now on this map. So, Ammo and uh, Moon Knight definitely be looking to win this one as China Infantry. Oh, Deadly Phoenix in chat. Hi there. Here we go then, next game on away guys. Game number nine at 4-4. Four, four. Been a good set between these two teams, two good good teams. Bottom left then in purple, China Infantry for ammo. And this is General Xin Fei. Top left, his teammate, drone straight in from uh, the Super Weapon General. His teammate in red, Moon Knight. Opposite him, his opponent, USA Super Weapon, with a bite taken out the command center there, <laughs> is Hesso, General Alexis Alexander. And China Vanilla, China V, for his teammate, Hummy. In the bottom right of Make Make, I do believe this map, isn't it? Yeah. Going to supplies then. Crates here in the back. Barracks up, power, supply center going up, sending a dozer to this dock, get another supply center up by the looks of it, for Hesso. Barracks and supply center up for Moon Knight, going early airfield as well, sending a dozer to collect here, nice. Two supplies already up for his teammate Ammo and two War Factories. Standard then for th this um, Infantry General, China Infantry. Surely going to be going Licks. Yeah, he's got the 
infantry units building up ready going for an inf licks capture upgrade on the ranger for um hesso it's gonna be going for these oils isn't they will that happen though with an inflix out from moon knight i don't know here she comes i'm gonna send in an outpost forward here there's a dragon coming forward from hummy flaming down this oil straight away my there's a cat somewhere in the mix here as well it comes the licks not a bunker on that licks yet there is now that dude has survived the hits from the licks what's going on here that's better this licks continues to press in there are migs up for hummy but there were migs up for hummy and that quick, all three MiGs down, and the Lix camps on the airfield. Taking out dozers as well. Oh man. Hummy hunted those two dozers together like that. Dropped early. With the Lix. Hummy selling up the airfield. Lix goes down. He had trouble targeting with that Lix, I felt there, did um, Moon Knight. Taking the power out now, though he hasn't taken the power out. Focusing on the gas. What are these two minigunners doing in the back here? Get back hitting. Am I moving in? Oh no, there is another dozer here for um, Hummy. This is his last dozer though, surely. Oh grief, look at this dragon in on Hummy as well. This is game, surely game already. Hummy's in dire straits. Not hunted yet, but will be. Yeah, GG from Hummy. So Hesso's playing on at the moment. It's a teammate. But, um... Yes. Another good dying noise here in, in the great game of Zero Hour. I just go get more Lixes. Yeah, I was just about to say, here comes another Lix from uh, um, Moon Knight. There's an airfield attempt going up from uh, Hesso, but um, yeah, he's got he's got search and destroy. He's got the strat center. He wants Alpha Auroras, but that ain't gonna happen, is it? Ammo capturing these two oils in the middle. They're filled up, but no sooner is it up, I think the Lix is gonna be taking it out. Taking the dozer. He drops. Oh, that's a bit of a dodgy drop, drop right on the ammo. So much fire firepower there, he's got away with it. As Moon Knight hitting the strat center now, retargeting on the V's. Yeah, GG from here, so. You have been defeated. Well played, guys. Although, not too hard with those armies, is it? Ammo and Moon Knight move to set point. 5-4. Gonna be really important now how these armies work out in it in this next um next matchup. So important. I hope it's not imbalanced. For the sake of the set, you know guys, it's been a good set. I wouldn't like to see it ended on an imbalanced matchup. We're on rubies and pearls, nice map. Good, good 2v2 map there, it's very popular. Bye Madara, good to have you here. And um, we have 26 viewers, welcome everybody on this glorious Saturday, weather-wise in the UK.
Oh, I've enjoyed this 2v2. I don't do them very often, but um, yeah, it's been good. So far. <laughs> this could be the last game. Can Team H bring it back to 5-5 and go tiebreaker? We got, oh, no way. Look at that, crazy. Can you believe it? All stealth. Oh, we need some uh, GLA music on, don't we? Definitely for this. Oh, man. Unbelievable. Uh, I will work. I will work. Can't believe that. Have you ever seen that before, guys? 2v2, all GLA stealth. That's mad. Bonkers, you. <laughs> well, it's winnable both ways, eh? <laughs> At least you've got equal armies. You ain't got an army imbalance. So, bottom left in gold, GLA Stealth for Hesso. His teammate, of course, in Stealth. Blue for Hummy. And to the right, they're very close together, aren't they, on this map, the two teams. Purple, Stealth for Ammo, and Stealth, of course, for Moon Knight in red. So, two docks in the back here. Got a forward dock here. And an oil derrick in uh, close to the middle there. A lot of crates in the centre here. Obviously, obviously, a lot of fighting obviously goes on here on this map. Buildings to occupy as well. RT platform. Another dock in the central area. Tunnel attempt going up there from Hesso with Moon Knight here. Gonna drop the music a little bit, guys. Worker coming forward for Moon Knight and tunnel attempts from ammo there. Tunnel attempts going up everywhere from all players. And he expanded to this dock and collecting from his safe in base dock, as is Moon Knight. It's expanded left to collect. Tunnel up and Hesso gonna occupy this building. He'll want to try and collect from this dock as soon as possible as well, won't he? Players Getting the grips with each other in the middle here, around all these crates, of course. Tech coming in from ammo on Hummy then. Trying to kill workers, he gets at least one. I think he got one worker there, just the one. Hummy's on it, defending well though. Yeah, that's good. Scrapped an aisle there for ammo, that was good. Tech coming in on Moon Knight here from Hesso. Nice. Killing workers. It's a good early result. And Tex harassing here from Hummy as well. Is Tex going to go down though? Could have been better microed that. Going to have a lot of tech action to start with, aren't we, in this game? Both teams fighting over this central area, of course. Moon Knight trying to get in on Hesso's eco. He can't. Ooh, a lot of freezing. We have had no problems with latency so far in this set. Oil captured here by Hesso. That's good. It's a worker trying to get a sneaky tunnel in here on the left-hand side. Hesso's made no attempt to come on this uh, area, although there is... A stealth rubble coming in from Hesso here. Oil refinery there yet to be captured. Buildings continue to whack away each other here in the center. There is an oil grab top left there just inside the picture. You can see Ammo looking to get that oil derrick. Terrorist coming forward here for Hummy. <laughs> 
so yeah this is still a problem for Hesso here though with, with Moon Knight occupying this building he's got the tunnel up there he's looking to deny this oil grab as well he, yeah he's gonna crush he does deny that's infuriating man that is very annoying I think Hesso will get that oil eventually but he's got to deal with this problem for this Oh, well played, Moon Knight. He's making a real nuisance of himself. There's at least there's two um, RPGs in that building as well, causing a lot of grief here for Hesso. I think that was Hummy trying to recapture Ammo's oil there. Didn't happen. Now, look at this. Quads galore pop from Moon Knight here. See what I mean, guys, about this area being real bad for Hesso. What's he doing with all these workers as well? What's happened here? Oh man, he's he's pressed the wrong button, hasn't he, on the workers, Moon Knight? Oh dear, no, 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 no. Oh no, 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 no. Going for, from bad to worse for Hesso then at the moment in this game. Moon Knight presses in the center looking to clear. Good pop from uh, Hesso there though. Combat cycle coming in. A rebel. Hesso's got a rebel here as well though. It's going to open up on this dude. Yeah, it kills him <laughs> with the splash damage from the barrels. Hesso's trying to capture this oil now, but that's not going to happen. Look, quad pop here. This is looking pretty good, though, for Hesso and... Um, Ami in the middle. Yeah, there's a lot of quads, so for... Ami. Uh, sorry, for Moon Knight. Well, look at this. He's got this area now, bottom left. Hesso's close to Hesso's base area. And Hesso's north of these tunnels. How bizarre. Collecting here, of course. But a massive battle going on here. Ammo's on battle buses as well. Already six minutes into the game. As I said in the beginning, when it guys often get massive battles around this central area. So much cash. I mean, he is collecting from here, though. Ammo clears Hummy from this area, moving in with his battle buses. There is a tech coming in from uh, Hummy, trying to get into to harass. Gonna look to try and recapture this oil, isn't he? Oh, he's taking it out. TT hit. Nice. Yeah, that's good. But. How's he going to deal with this? There's no tunnel over there either from his teammate. Oh dear. I mean, there's a closest tunnel from Hesso is there. This area's gone. And look at this. Moon Knight's pressing. This is looking really desperate for the for Team H. GG's from Hesso and Hummy. You have been they take it guys 6-4 well played well played in that game ended quite quick actually but um yeah that tunnel in that area bottom left for Moon Knight was very telling they had the units um, in the center as well and then ammo of course on those battle buses so quick the man let's get the score up 6-4 for ammo and Moon Knight they take the set and the hundred dollars sponsored by Pepsi in this hundred dollar challenge. Big thanks to the sponsor, Mr. Pepsi. Well pay, played both teams. It's good.
Yeah. It was well played, very well played. Let's just check on um, Discord. Good. Well, that's it then, guys. I hope you enjoyed that. Um, yeah, it was a nice change. I enjoyed that myself, doing a 2v2. Like I said, not my normal scene, but... um. It was good. Yeah, it was good. Congratulations to Moon Knight and Ammo on their win in that challenge and commiserations to Team H, to Heso and Hami. All right then, guys, that's me done. Till next time, hope you have a, a great weekend. We got bank holiday here, so that means we have the Monday off in the United Kingdom uh, to enjoy this lovely weather that we've got. And until next time then, folks, this is end of the stream and have a good Saturday. Not sure if anyone else is streaming anything else, on, you know, uh, on, on this Saturday. Hope so. Hope we have some good Saturday night entertainment. And until next time, then dudes, this is Alfie Ace out. Bye-bye.